Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I am going to show you everything that I keep in my diaper bag for two babies under two years old. If you guys are new here, my name is Allie. I have a son who is almost two and a daughter who is almost six months, so very busy with little tiny babies around here. I make lots of vlogs and mom content, so if you like videos like that, make sure to subscribe. I'm also gonna show you guys everything that I keep in my little in the car organizer. I will show you that after my diaper bag, but that's just some of the essentials that I like to keep in the car all the time. So for the past almost two years, I have had the same diaper bag the entire time. I bought this diaper bag on Amazon when I was pregnant with my son. This is a Miss Fong diaper bag. And I have loved this bag the entire time I have been using it. I actually did a video showing what's in my diaper bag with this. So if you guys wanna see how I organized it back then and everything, I will link that video for you guys. But now with two babies, I kind of wanted to size up a little bit and I just wanted to try something different, get like a new look. And Miss Fong actually reached out to me and asked if they could send me a new diaper bag. And I was like, yes, I already love the diaper bag that I have from you guys that I bought with my own money. So I did let them send me this because I knew I was gonna love it and I am obsessed. The one I had before, this one was a backpack and it also had the shoulder strap. And now having two, I found myself pretty much only using this one as a backpack. So I was interested in getting one that just was a backpack and would be a little bit more comfortable as a backpack. So I found this one and I just thought that this thing was so pretty. I love the lighter leather material. I love the gold accents. It is a little bit on the bigger side, but I like that about it because I like to be very well prepared. I am one of those people who would way rather have too much than not enough. And this diaper bag lets you be so, so organized. It is crazy. There are so many different pockets and things in this diaper bag, it's amazing. So there are two side pockets right here. I don't ever find that these are actually like big enough to put a water bottle in or anything. So I use these for things that I like need to just be able to grab easily. And um, when we're out and about, I'll put my car key in here. So on this side, I just have a lip gloss and <laughs> a mint from the bank that I just tucked in there. On this side, there are two chapsticks and a pack of gum. So then you open this flap up and there are two big pocket areas. This one is nice because it will zip all the way down. And then you have this netted pocket on the front and then you have all of these compartments right here. In this front pocket, I just keep a reusable grocery bag and a little teething toy for just in case. So in this front little pocket right here, <laughs> this is probably overkill, but I have three little different sunscreens. I have a little spray one. This is just a regular classic sunscreen and another spray one. Like I said, I always have more than enough, but it's better than being underprepared. So I have those in there. And then in the pocket next to it, I have a hand lotion and a hand sanitizer. In this big pocket here, I just have a face mask just in case and that is all I have in there. So then moving on to the big pockets. This is like the main diaper bag compartment and you can like see how big it is and how much stuff you can fit in here. There's like the main open area and then there's so many pockets around the sides too that you can put things in. So I keep all of our diapers and wipes right here in our big main compartment. We really like the Target wipes and we use the Target diapers as well. And I have a ton. I think I have like four or five in each size. I feel like every time I watch another person's like what's in their diaper bag video, they only have like one or two diapers in there. And I can't wrap my head around that. I like to have so many just in case, especially with like a younger baby. I feel like she can blow through diapers so quickly. And usually when we're gone somewhere, we're gone for a while. So I like to be over prepared with diapers. So under all of those, I have a few other things. A muslin swaddle, basically just in case it gets a little chilly or if I need something to cover up the car seat or something to put down on the ground to like lay her on top of. There's so many different uses for these and I like to just always have one just in case. I also like to have an extra shirt for myself. This is so essential and I feel like I don't see people talking about these in their diaper bags enough. This is really important when you have a younger baby who spits up or anything like that. I know I have been spit up all over in public and it is really, really nice to have something to change into if you need to, if you don't wanna smell like baby puke or whatever. Stuff happens when you have little kids. So this is essential and it really doesn't take up that much space and you will thank yourself later. And then also in this big apartment, I have my blowout kits. These are another thing that are so, so essential and these have saved my butt so many times. 
I have one for each baby and basically all it is is just a Ziploc bag with a change of clothes. It's easy with the Ziploc bag because you can like really squeeze all of the air out of there and so it really doesn't take up much space at all. This has saved my butt so many times when we have been out in public and one of our babies has had a big blowout where their poo gets all over their clothes and I'm always so relieved that I have this that you can just change them into a new outfit and then you have a plastic bag to put their dirty outfit in so that you don't have to worry about the smell or poo getting all over anything you can change them and then put all of their dirty clothes into this Ziploc bag it's amazing so for my daughter I just have a little onesie outfit it's just one piece and then for my son he doesn't have blowouts anymore he's a toddler but you never know in public if they're going to spill all over themselves and get really wet sometimes you are out and about and there's a splash pad and they run into it like you just never know when you're gonna need a change of clothes so he has just a little pair of shorts and a shirt and also an extra pair of socks just in case. These are a lifesaver. I always make sure to switch these out um, for the seasons. And honestly, I just keep outfits in here that I really don't like because they're not gonna get used that much, but they're gonna come in handy. So these go all the way at the bottom of the diaper bag. Now that it's empty, you can kind of see all of the other pockets. This one back here, I keep tons of little snacks for my toddler. Honestly, usually I have more snacks in here than that, but we've been using them. And also whenever we leave the house, I always bring a sippy cup with us. And then in this pocket, I have our portable sound machine for our younger baby. If she ever needs to take a nap on the go in the car seat or anything like that, these really, really come in handy. And then I also have an extra pacifier in here for her as well. Never want to be caught outside of the house without a pacifier. And then on either side right here, these are insulated pockets if you needed to keep a bottle or something like that. We don't use bottles, um, but in this side, I just have a diaper rash cream and then this side is empty. This zipper pocket, I keep all of my kind of essential stuff in here, which is really not much. Honestly, I just have some pads and a ton of hair ties. I usually keep a granola bar for me in here as well, but I ate it, so I need to put a new one in here. Always have snacks for you and your kids in your diaper bag. And then this last big pocket here, I always keep one of these small receiving blanket. We use these for a million things too, but these always come really in handy for burp cloths or if there's like spit up or a spill. This diaper bag came with a changing pad, which is amazing, so convenient and this one is really really big and nice and it folds up and has a little snap the last thing I have in this pocket is our three-in-one cover this is one of those covers that you can use as a nursing cover or car seat cover we mostly use it to put over the cart at the grocery store or over a high chair if we're out to eat somewhere this one also has these little clips right here which are so great that you can clip this to your stroller which is really nice and it also has a pocket right here on the back that you could fit like an ipad or a computer or anything in so yeah that is everything that i have in our diaper bag for our two babies also when they sent me the diaper bag they also sent me this really cute little stroller organizer that i wanted to show you guys how cute it looks like a purse it's so pretty this is like a little parent organizer that you can strap onto your stroller which is so convenient and i have never seen one that is like this pretty the flap lifts up like this it has two insulated little drink pockets so you could put your water bottle or your coffee or whatever in there and then so much space for anything else that you might need to put in there phone, wallet, whatever you need to do while you are strolling around. This is so cute. I really, really love this. I will have all three of these diaper bags linked down below if you want to try them. And then last thing, really quick, I want to show you our little car organizer of just some extra stuff that I always have with us in the car. I drive a big old minivan, so I have plenty of room for this on the floor right next to my son's car seat, but obviously you could get something a little bit smaller than this or keep it in the trunk, anything like that. I know for me, whenever I like just try to leave the house for a really quick trip and I don't bring the diaper bag, we just need to like run and grab something really fast. That is always when my son poos and I don't have a diaper with me and it's always a huge thing. So that's when I started having this little organizer that is always in the car just in case. Just a little plastic basket from Target, nothing fancy. I always have another thing of wipes. It's always nice to like wipe hands or anything you might need to. And then I just keep two diapers in each size in here. I also have a little baby quilt. Always convenient if you need to like lay down on the ground to let her you know roll around on or if it's cold i have a little sweater for my toddler just in case and i also have a 
bottle of sunscreen in here as well. Those are my essentials. And then also on the other side, I always like to keep a bunch of little fun, interesting toys in the car. I try to rotate these around too. So there's always something kind of fresh and interesting. And it's not just like the same boring old things. That makes life way easier in the car if they have something kind of like new and interesting to look at. Some books for my toddler to look at, as well as just a few little I always like to get like little dollar store toys or stuff from like the dollar spot at Target Just stuff that's like interesting and new to really keep them like focused and interested in the car So this is everything that I keep in my little car organizer and I just keep this like right on the floor of my van All right I think that is everything I have to show you for this video If I'm missing something from my diaper bag or you have something else that you recommend Please leave it in the comments so that I can see it and that other moms can go through and read the comments as well And like I said, I will have all of these diaper bags linked down below if you want to check them out thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and follow us on instagram and i will see you guys all in our next video